Alright you guys, what is going on? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to look at Mike Singletary. Now I do believe, I've seen him once before, the name rings a bell, I can recognise him, he's got glasses, I feel like. And uh, I think, from, from, from memory, I feel like he was a part of the Bears 1985 team, the real dominant one. I feel like I've seen him in a video about William Perry, the fridge. But we're about to find out. So without further ado, let's get into it. The quicker you here, the faster you go. That's why where I come from, the only thing we know is People say the eyes are the there it is. to the soul. Well, if you played opposite Mike Singletary, you saw everything that was going on in his soul because those eyes were just lit up. I mean, and it never blinked. Nobody was more prepared than Mike Singletary. Hey! Hey! Hold down! Hold down! Hey! I think two things. Pow! Mike Singletary, very unique. Number one is intelligence. Hey, Coach. I, I know what you're trying to do and stuff with the stirs and stuff like that. But man, it's a big hole in the front. And his passion for the game. Nobody played it with more passion than Mike Singletary. <laughs> hey, baby! We're gonna be here all day! We're gonna be here all day, baby! I like this kind of party! I like this kind of party, baby! Yeah, I can close my eyes today. I can see Richard Dent. Get out of here! Mike Singletary. I can see <laughs> Wilbur Marshall. It was like chaos. Mike was the centerpiece of it all. Let's have a goal line stand. Let's have a goal line stand. Michael held it together. Extremely bright guy. Had to be to play that kind of defense. Check four. God gives us athletic ability. Watch him in the fly. What do you do between your ears is what makes you a great player. Absolutely. I would have loved to see Mike Singletary. I would have loved to see the whole team play back, back in the day. It would have been an amazing sort of dynasty. That's exactly right, mate. Those are some wise words. You can have all the talent in the world, all the physical talent, all the physical gifts, but if you're not mature enough or you don't want to educate yourself enough behind all that, then it kind of, it doesn't not mean anything, but it kind of diminishes the, the importance, you know? It's like that saying, hard work beats talent, but when talent works hard, it's all over. <laughs> That's actually not how the saying goes, but something like that. <laughs> That's the area where Mike really excelled. Burn you, bro! Burn you! Burn you! Go, go! Being able to get people lined up, knowing how to flow, how to run under blocks if you need to, how to take on a big 300-pound guard, shed him and go make a play, and the intuitive nature of reading plays. Oh, shit! What a hit! Oh, mate! And Mike Singletary is one of those unique individuals that when you sit with Mike, he will move you. The fact that he's a head coach today doesn't surprise me one bit. That's where the glasses are. One of the most moving moments I've ever had in my life was in a sit-down interview with 15 minutes with Mike Singletary when I was broadcasting. Mike came in to sit down and he talked about the passion, he talked about the preparation, he talked about what he wanted to do, and he talked about his faith. People say, oh, that guy's great, oh, this guy's terrific, oh, this guy's well, no, I was in the presence of greatness. I was truly in the presence of greatness. Greatness. Wow. Now that is a wrap and a half. Mike, I, I did have a lot of respect for him from what I heard, the way I heard he, him speak. I didn't actually know that he was a head coach, he might not still be one, but um, from what I saw in the, the video previously about the Chicago Bears that I've watched, I already respected him, I knew that he was legit. And um, that video just sums it all up really. Smart player, onto it, the eyes never blinked, strong and great in all the ways that an NFL player can be, NFL legend, 
He is an NFL legend. He's number 57 on the greatest players of all time. All right, everybody, that was that. I hope you enjoyed. In the next video, we're going to be looking at Gene Upshaw, continuing on this journey that is the top 100 NFL's greatest players of all time. I hope you've enjoyed. If you have, hit the like button. If you want to subscribe, please do. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.